Hello everyone. Today I'm going to be showing my design for an infinitely expandable, extremely fast shulker box unloader. So a couple things to get out of the way straight away is I have two kinds of shulker boxes, empty ones and shulker boxes with nine stacks of items. The amount of items is really irrelevant because the system will work with any amount, but I just needed an amount that would trigger the system and stay there for a little while for good testing. So I think nine stacks is a good amount. I have a chest already uh, prepared with all of these different items kind of sorted randomly about. So let's hop straight into it and see this thing working. So straight away you can see the shulker box will system will break the shulker box and then unload the one here. So it does exactly what it says. It unloads shulker boxes. And it does so at 140,000 items or 144,000 items per hour in my one input 16 output design, which means every every uh, chest or inventory item on that one block will be sucked out and distributed to 16 hoppers. I say this is expandable because my design can be expanded as far as you want. I, I got a working prototype of a 256 output um, version of this in the test world. I have videos on a 32 and a 64 output if you would like them, they are in the description below. Now I made this design because I haven't really seen anything like this. I've seen shulker box on loaders but nothing this fast and I didn't know why so I decided I'd make one. Now I've seen shulker box loaders, link to that in the description, but not unloaders. So every other one I've seen just unloads like a hopper. Now what I've got set up here is all of your items, or in this case purple, block, purple bricks, all of your items would be sorted out here and then all of the full shulker boxes or non-stackable items or not items not sorted in your system will end up here. You can see that every single one of these is empty and it sorts as fast as I think is possible. So you can see the system is sorting. I thought it was off. No, it is off. Uh, it's just unloading the last one. So I guess how it works, let me just demonstrate once more, is it starts this clock when there is no shulker box. When there is a shulker box, or isn't any items being sorted. When there are items being sorted, it turns off this clock immediately, unloads the items, and then when it detects an empty shulker box, starts this clock again. That's what's going on. If we're lucky enough to get enough in a row that don't have many, or don't have any items, you should see this working. I'm going to wait just a second. Well, it didn't go. It didn't go that time, but it cuts the circuit and it would make a clock. So that's all the wiring there. There will be a world download with this in the description and links to how to build this in the description as well. Uh, I believe that's all there is to say. Um, if you have a normal sorting system, uh, I have found that shulker boxes, like any non-stackable item, actually have a signal strength of three, which I can demonstrate here. And then just put it in there. And then uh, what you would do with this system is this actually sorts out non-stackable items so as soon as the signal strength of three is achieved it'll unlock this hopper. This is pretty good if you want to just sort these out and you don't want it to be at the end but you want it to be alongside your stream. You could put one of those in your system. So a couple problems to in this design is exactly what just happened there. Perfect timing. Uh, when the thing is full it actually gets a little clogged up. The hopper minecarts when it's under heavy load can't actually sort the items fast enough. I haven't thought of a solution as of this video uh, really all I've been doing is putting hoppers around here. Now because only shulker boxes will ever enter this, as far as I know, um, you would be able to just put that into an extra chest, so if they all led here, I mean, it would be the same as that chest if you wanted to link them up. That would work fine, but as I have it in this version, they just kind of get clogged up. In the world download, I'll fix this for you, no problem. I believe that's all there is to say about this design. Uh, if you want a tutorial, you can message me. But I just like to provide world downloads and or schematics and just let people kind of mess with the design on their own. Um, I think that's it for this video. Uh, if you liked it, like the video. If you disliked it, dislike the video. If your feelings are more complicated than that, send me an angry personal message. No, I mean, you, I mean the comment section. Yeah, do that. That's it for me. Thanks for watching.